Hello all. I'm Archana Bhuswale, Assistant Professor at AI Assessments IOIT. In this video, we are going to discuss the earned value analysis which is used for software project management. So what is earned value analysis? It is basically used for the tracking the project progress against the schedule, against the plan. So we'll see the details of that. What is earned value analysis? So the project management presents the many tools and techniques for the management of the successful project. And one of the most effective and regarded of these tools is a earn value analysis. So EVA is a method basically that allows the project manager to measure the amount of work actually performed on a project beyond the basic review of the cost and schedule report. It, or actually, what it does is a measure of the measure the amount of work actually performed on a project beyond the basic review of cost and schedule report. So EBA provides a method that permits the project to be measured by progress achieved. The project manager is then able, using the progress measure, to forecast a project's total cost and date of completion based on the trend analysis or applications of the project's burn rate. This method relies on a key measure which is known as the project's earned value. Oftentimes, the term earned value is defined as the budgeted cost of work performed or BCW. So this budgeted cost of work performed measure enables the project manager to compute performance in the assays or burn the rates for cost and schedule performance, which provides information on how well the project is doing or performing relative to its original plans. These indices, when applied to future work, it allows for the project manager to forecast how the project will do in future, assuming the burn rates will, which will not fluctuate, which oftentimes is a large assumption. Obviously, that is a large assumption that these particular rates will not fluctuate, but in actuality, it, in actuality, in, it may fluctuate and there are the more chances on so in earned value management, unlike in traditional management, there are three data sources which we are going to use, or three values you can say, and the earned value analysis works on these three values only. Okay, so the first data source or value you can say is the budget. That is a budget or planned value of work schedule. Budget or planned value of the work schedule. Next one, the actual value of the work completed. And the third one, that is the earned value of the physical work complete. Okay, so earned value analysis works on three these three data sources. So earned value takes these three data sources and is able to compare the budgeted value of the work schedule with the earned value of the physical work completed and the actual value of the work completed. It will compare them. So when we are saying these three sources are there, so we are going to discuss what these three sources are exactly. So first one is a planned value. Planned value is that what it is. It is basically described how far along the project work is supposed to be at any given point in the project schedule and cost estimate. So cost and schedule baseline refers to the physical work schedule and approved budget for to accomplish the schedule work. Together, they result in an important value that is the planned value. PV can be looked at in two ways: cumulative and current. So cumulative PV is the sum of approved budget for activities scheduled to be performed today. Current PV is the approved budget for activities scheduled to be performed during a given period. This period will represent days, weeks, months, and years. So PV also known as the budgeted cost of the work scheduled, work scheduled, okay, PCW, which can be defined as it defines the scope, what you are tasked to do, that is scope statement. Assign the scope, that is, break down the scope into the manageable part, that is, WBS, and then schedule the scope, time phase logic driven with critical path, project schedule. And the last one is the project scope, develop the cost for all the approved scope, and then finally the base, which is in the snapshot in time, which is frozen. What performance measurement will be based? So that is the plan and value. It is called, it is also called as a cost of budget cost of the work schedule that is a PCW. Now the actual cost. What is the actual cost? Actual cost also known as the actual expenditures, right? So it is a cost incurred for executing the work on a project. This figure, this cost will tell you what you have spent 
and as with planned value can be looked at in terms of cumulative and current so cumulative actual cost is the sum of actual cost for activities performed to date up to the day, up to till date, till date whatever the activities are performed uh, sum of all the value will and that will give us the cumulative actual value, cost so current ac current actual cost is the actual cost of activities performed during a given period of time this period could represent days weeks months etc so ac is also called as actual cost of work performed ac is also called as the actual cost of work performed whereas the planned value is also called as a budgeted cost of the work schedule okay so that is the difference between this the next one that is the earned value to report the accomplishment of the project you must apply earned value to the figures and calculations in the project ev is the quantification of the work of the work done to date in other words ev tells you in physical terms what the project has accomplished as with planned value and actual value what we ev can be represented in a cumulative and current fashion as planned value actual value can be presented in the cumulative and current fashion same way ev can also be presented in the cumulative and current fashion so cumulative ev is a sum of budget for the activities accomplished to date so current ev is a sum of budget for the activities accomplished in a given period earned value is also called as a budgeted cost of work performed budgeted cost of work performed so planned value is sometimes is determined by the cost and scheduled baseline actual cost is determined by the actual cost incurred on the project whereas the earned value tells you in physical terms what the project accomplished what the project has accomplished okay so that's all about the earned value analysis thank you